Imagine for a second playing football for Florida State, first in your conference with an undefeated 13-0 record, and you think you're going to get a shot at proving you're the best in the nation. Then you find out you didn't make the championship playoffs, and two of the teams that made it each lost a game this season. Dana Jacobson looks at the decision that's shaking the foundations of college football. This right here, touchdown Florida State. After a formidable college football weekend, there is both clarity and chaos. Great blocker, call, touchdown Wolverines. With a commanding Big Ten championship win on Saturday, the Michigan Wolverines captured the playoffs' top spot. But in Tallahassee, the party was quickly over. Plumber. Even though Florida State capped off an undefeated season Saturday, on Sunday, Texas and Alabama jumped ahead of the Seminoles. We get left out even when we win. Marking the first time an unbeaten Power Five Conference champion missed the playoff, which started in 2014. Heartbroken, devastated. This was the moment Florida State coach Mike Norvell and his team learned they were out. Norvell later said he was disgusted and infuriated with the decision. CBS Sports' Dennis Dodd. It's not a credible playoff when you don't have the, the best teams or the teams that have achieved the most. The selection committee chairman said quarterback Jordan Travis's season-ending injury was a major factor. You feel horrible for Coach Norvell, the players, you know, but again, they're a different team now than they were uh, earlier in the year. This might be Michigan's best team ever. We'll know if they win the championship. Michigan's season played amid scandal. Head coach Jim Harbaugh was suspended by the Big Ten for three games after allegations of sign stealing. Harbaugh denied any knowledge of the alleged scheme while a former staffer is at the center of the NCAA's investigation. Michigan will take on the Crimson Tide in the Rose Bowl on New Year's Day. While in the Sugar Bowl, the Texas Longhorns will try to hook the Huskies. Lobs it into the end zone, touchdown! Dana Jacobson, CBS News.